Jude. Uh, yeah? What you doing? Uh, oh, I was just, uh, checking focus. Right. Hey, you know, Professor Watts, the camera really loves you. My short film is an erotic thriller, and, and I could really use someone of your, uh, talents. Dream on. <laughs> Can't blame a guy for trying. I can, actually. <laughs> I'm gonna need a boob, too. Just make sure to sign it out with the rest of the equipment. Hey. I thought you weren't shooting until this weekend. No, it's fine. It's fine. I told you to call if you needed help. Give me uh, 15 minutes, something like that, and I'll stop by on my way out. Yeah, okay. All right. Sounds good. <laughs> Nice location. Okay, guys. Not funny, come out. Are you, are you filming me?
doesn't look like very much clay. Oh, it's enough. Put this around your neck. Watts was going to lead a discussion today, but I guess she got held up. So, as the assistant teacher, I will be leading the discussion today. Uh, so what do you think the director is? Okay, you guys are dismissed. Um, how about... Uh, okay, that's fine. Um, you guys... Maddie! Please tell me you're coming this weekend, please. Please. I, I don't know. It seems like a bad idea. Are you kidding? It's gonna be amazing. A weekend getaway from campus. We'll have vodka, and you know Lando's gonna have pot. Noah's gonna be there. Oh, right. Yeah, that's weird. Solution, complete and utter avoidance. It's a big cabin, plenty of room to avoid, right? You don't even know that. It's probably big. Krog! Yo! How big is your dad's cabin? Cabins, plural, as in multiple. You coming? I don't know. Tabitha! I heard you're shooting a horror film this weekend for your final project. You heard that. That's what we heard. Congratulations, that's awesome for you. So, uh, what's your monster? My what? Oh my god, your subgenre. <laughs> Ghosts, exorcism, creature feature. Actually, it's a slasher flick. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. Would you say that's the lowest uh, form of entertainment? Yeah, like right here, Kardashians. And right above that, uh, slasher movies. For your information, the original Halloween happens to be a cinematic masterpiece. Oh, shut up. Oh. What exactly are you guys doing for your project? Remains of the day? It's an autobiographical drama, actually. Man's search for meaning. Whoa, oh my god. I'm so sorry. I seem to have fallen asleep. How long have you been talking? You're hilarious. Entertaining. That's the word you're looking for, buddy. Have fun this weekend at your cinematic uh, circle jerk. Oh, so your film is going to be boring and sophomoric. Good luck. <laughs> Tabitha, are you fully casted yet? Yes. Uh, maybe. Why? You know Maddie, right? She's an amazing actress. Hi. Oh, yeah? Have you studied? Um, yeah, she's got an agent and everything. And check out this look. Blonde hair, blue eyes. She's America's sweetheart. Hmm. Huh. Well, we already have our final girl, but... Yeah, but... Yeah. I might have something for you if you come out this weekend. Yeah. Bring a bunch of changes of clothes so I have options. Something you don't mind getting bloody. Ooh, yeah. Yes. She <laughs> is so good, you won't believe it. Um, so, who's bringing booze? I don't like beer. This is not a weekend rager. This is work. If you guys are coming out this weekend, you have to be committed to the film. Jesus Christ, Tabitha. Lando's doing the beer run, okay? Talk to him. Oh, tell him I want some Jaeger. Ow! Boom. Are you, being to you want to be famous? You want to be an actress? Who helps you out? Who sets you up? You do. Damn right. We need to find Lando. Don't like being assaulted. Okay, yeah, the film sounds cool, and I could always use another credit, and I'm an amazing actress. But I already started working on my project, and I've been successfully avoiding Noah for like 10 days now, and Stand I... Up. Where's Lando? Your little Carlo, looking foxy. Who even says that? Jacob, focus. Where's Lando? Have you seen him? Oh, uh, yeah, you said he's going to get liquor for this weekend. Shit! You guys coming to this thing? You guys should come. It's gonna be lit. Hey, Maddie. Oh, hey, Cam. You doing the film shoot this weekend? Mm, I don't know. Maybe. You? Yeah, Tabitha wants me to act in it. Oh, cool. Me too. Really? Yeah. That is, that's cool. I'm the guy who seems like the good guy, but might turn out to be the killer. Maddie! It would... Oh, bye, Cam. Maybe I'll see you. Maddie, how much money do you have? None. Zero. Mando, come on. What could possibly make you think that I would drop my own money to buy you booze? Because you're nice. Yeah, a nice capitalist. You want liquor, I want some cash. That sounds reasonable. Fine. How about a ride? Can we get a ride? Is that too much to ask? Yeah, I could do that. We're leaving at three. Don't be late. Thank you, Lando. Thank, Thank you, Lando. 
Damn, he's so hot. Yeah, I'm not going. Why? I'm just gonna get some vodka for my roommate, and by the time she realizes I took it, we'll be in the middle of nowhere. It's literally not about vodka. You're going, you deserve this, okay? We're gonna go, we're gonna party our faces off, and you're gonna be in tap with this movie, and then on Sunday, when we drive back, you'll be done with your part of the film project, and everyone will know that you're totally over Noah. What if I'm not? You are. Now, let's go pack, and don't forget to bring something sexy. I'm not doing that. I'm thinking a low-cut flannel kind of thing. So like a hot, rustic camper look? <sighs> Can we make room for the camera? Is that OK? It's only the whole reason for this trip. Why are you yelling? Hi. <laughs> are you with the film? Uh, Catherine? Yeah. Hi, I'm Abigail. I'm the producer. You were so good in Chicago. Thank you so much. That show was so fun, but this is going to be great for me. I, my, my resume is a little theater heavy, and I could really use some film credits. <laughs> yeah. So. Uh, hey, can I put this in a car somewhere? You're the makeup artist, right? That's me, Lori. Awesome. She's amazing. So talented. Uh, who are you? That's Pete. I'm Pete. Oh, funny story. Pete was hanging out in the dance studio and uh -huh. just overheard us talking about shooting a film and wanted to tag along. Yeah, it was like, I'm not doing anything this weekend, so... Isn't that so fun? So fun. Uh, okay, I guess I can put you to work. Do you know how to set up a C-stand? What's a C-stand? So, can I put this in a car, or...? Hey, tons of room in my ride. I'm Jacob. Catherine. <laughs> Hey, Crop, I need to sit in the front. Oh, well, that's a shame because, uh, because I, uh, definitely, most certainly, absolutely call shotguns. But I'm the producer. No, no, not in real life. In real life, you are just another college student named Abigail who did not call shotgun. I get car sick. That's sad. Now, I know, for me, if I got car sick easily and I knew that about myself, well, you could uh, bet for damn sure I'd be calling shotgun. Like, right away, you know? <laughs> hey, you should try that. You're an asshole, Krom. An asshole in the front seat. Wait, wait for me. I almost didn't make it. Maddie. I, I'm so happy that you talked me into this. It's a small school. What am I going to do, avoid my ex-boyfriend forever? Let's just have a fun weekend. OK, but Maddie, listen to me. We've got room for one. Oh, we can't ride together? Um, We've got a seat over here. We're pulling out. Let's go. <sighs> OK, hey. Thank you for talking me into this. You're right. I need a break. I'll see you there. But Maddie, wait. Ah, OK. Wait, uh, where do I? Hi, Noah. Oh, hey. Kayla. Maddie. This is a surprise. Funny, I was thinking the same thing. Well then, lucky us. like my first foray into filmmaking, I'm feeling really confident. You obviously know me for my student government work, but being a producer is just so much better, you know? It's like the perfect combination of organization and art. And I love organizing. <sighs> Thanks for letting me sit up front. I get super car sick. It's actually really difficult. And I know, like, I'm such a pacifist, but like, I wasn't ready to hit her. So, Catherine, do you act? What kind of act? I'm not sure what that means. She, she does it all. She's amazing. She's the best in her class. Did you see Chicago? Uh, no. So good. I love Shakespeare and drama and musicals and comedy, but it's almost like, it's like unfair because of my gift. I'm an empath. She feels other people's emotions. It allows me to understand people in a way that most just can't. I'm gonna do you. Sorry? She's going to read you. Oh, yes, I love this. You're an athlete. Basketball. And you don't give a shit about theater or film or show tunes. Wow. You're amazing. You have no idea. Oh, it's like Abigail has to puke. Ah, oh, man. That 
is awesome. Babe, what you doing? <laughs> Just gonna <laughs> deface that private property, huh? It's a mask! Get it for the murderer! That's supposed to be scary? Yeah. Oh my god, it's Scarecrow Head. Everybody look out, it's Scarecrow Head. That shit's not scary. That's probably the least scary thing I've ever seen. Shut up! You have no respect for the artistic process, and you know nothing about cinema. You feeling poorly? I, I, uh... You're not supposed to be here. It's not. Oh, hey, hey, get in there, get in there. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Uh, please, big gun over Crazy there. Hassers. I could shoot you just for being here. Our friend was sick. Oh. Broken hearted. Young love betrayed. Don't be sad, pretty girl. He's going to die. And her, too. All of them. I see blood everywhere. Right. Okay. <laughs> Let's just leave this nice lady's property then, okay? I'm very sorry about this. I got the touch. I see things. Good to know. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go. Oh, you can run, but you can't get away. down for the season. We can shoot all night. No permits, no nosy neighbors calling the cops. Wait a minute. No Wi-Fi? No cell service either. No one told me I was going to be offline. Oh my god. How are you ever going to survive? Guys, Insta's not even working. I'll check Snap. Go choose your cabins. We have a production meeting in 15 minutes. An hour. You just undermine me in front of the entire cast and It crew. doesn't matter. Oh my god, relax. Have a drink. Everybody have a drink. Hey. I believe this one's yours. Yeah, thanks. Look, Maddie, um, no, I'm sorry I... about... I need to talk to you. In a minute, okay? Um, just... it's kind of important. Excuse us. See you around. I want it to have a real Kurosawa feel. You want it to have a real samurai feel? <laughs> you must take everything so literally. Or I don't know what the hell you're talking about. His oeuvre. What? Okay, this isn't bad. Mm. Mmm, okay. Wow. Oh. Oh, uh -huh. <laughs> all right. Johnson's mm. mm. <laughs> got into you today. Wow. What are you doing here? 
Get out! Just shutting off the water. You know, it's coming on now, winter. What? Don't want to freeze the pipes now, do you? Get out of here! <laughs> what? Are you gonna make me? What? Are you gonna make me? blocking the window to make it look like nighttime. Grog! Everybody get out here! Whoa! What are you yelling about? This perv was hiding in the bathroom watching us. Hey, look at all the kitties. Hey man, what's up? Larry, right? Remember me? My name ain't Larry. Well shit. <laughs> I'm sorry, I I don't remember it. It's it's me, you know, uh, uh, Werner, Werner Cragero. <laughs> oh, little Werner. Okay. Your name is Werner. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> hey, man. Look, uh, I'm I'm sorry. I I totally forgot you were gonna be here this weekend. Uh, look, man. I, <laughs> come on. I mean, I I know you. You're the caretaker of my family. I'm just totally blanking on your name right now. I'm Vic. Vic. Vic, right. Uh, well, Vic, we're gonna be here for the weekend. That's cool. Nobody told me. Right. Well, surprise, right? <laughs> I'm telling you right now. I don't work for you. Well, you kind of do. <laughs> I work for Mr. Gregario. Right. Um, and as I previously stated, that's who I am. You ain't your daddy. Okay, we're kind of going in circles here, pal. Listen, we are gonna be here for the weekend. Not okay. if I don't hear from Mr. Gregario. Holy shit, okay. Um, so, how about I call my dad, and on the phone, he tells you, okay. okay. Um, Vic, hi, I'm Abigail, the producer. Uh, I just wanted to let you know that we're gonna be shooting a horror film here, so if you hear any screams or see anything crazy, just don't worry about it, okay? I'll be at my cabin. It's just on the other side of the... Cam, if, if you want to stop by later, I got me an Xbox. Um, no thank you. Yeah. Yeah. I'll be expecting that call from Mr. Gagero. Yeah, sure thing, pal. Oh, that's I thought it. Oh, shit, yeah. Nice. What did I do? Sure you're not interested? Bro. Said he's got an Xbox. Yeah, think you mind if we showed up? Look. Johnny? Johnny, answer me. Johnny! 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 Cut! Cameron. Yeah. Did I... I thought... No! You were supposed to... What was he supposed to do? Johnny attacks her with his knife passionately as if his life depends on it, he cuts her throat. Thank you. Welcome. Is he gonna be doing it like that? No. Cameron. I thought I was supposed to say, Johnny, please don't. Cameron, you put the knife to her throat and then she says, Johnny, please don't. Totally. That totally makes sense. I'm sorry, Tabitha. This is why we have rehearsals. Are we really going to be using this knife? Oh, I hope not. No, that is not. Uh, uh, props? Props. Props! Maddie, you are props. And we are having a props issue. I thought I was acting. That's later. So right now, props. This is not the right knife. Can you get the cool one with the special effects blood? Um. Um. There's not another knife in here. It doesn't matter. Where is it? I spent like $30 on it. I literally have no idea. You just told me I was props like two seconds ago. The knife doesn't matter. But where is it? Can you stop yelling? Okay. 
we're gonna take a second and problem solve here. So we're gonna look for the prop knife, and Maddie, Maddie, you're gonna find us a backup knife in case the other one doesn't turn up, okay? Okay, so you want me to get a knife? Yes! Okay, I will go get a knife or whatever. I will never forgive you. Go do your job, prop! Catherine, you're not using a real knife in the scene. Yeah, that sounds really dangerous. I wouldn't. I want it to be as real as possible. Just like Meisner. Hello? Careful with that thing. You snuck up on me. I didn't sneak. I walked up on you. Why are you doing anything up on me? What do you want? Just to talk. Talk to your girlfriend. And she's not my girlfriend. Really? Does she know that? Because maybe me and her should have a little talk and we can compare notes. Look, I didn't know you were going to be up here this weekend. And I didn't know you were bringing the flavor of the week. What is your problem? What do you think my problem is? Look, I know she can be a little bit... Easy? Aggressive. We've been broken up for 10 days. 10 days, Noah. I'm sorry. <laughs> because you weren't ready to commit. Well, you know what? I need to take this knife to my movie set because I'm props. Maddie... Just... Leave me alone. <sighs> Where is everybody? Drinking, ruining the movie. Nobody cares. I brought your knife. My what? You sent me for a knife, I, I got it. Super. Krog said he couldn't light the shot until dark, so he called a lunch break. A get wasted break. Okay, so I'm just gonna leave this here. You tell them that we're shooting as soon as the sun sets. You tell them all. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, this one, this one. You guys might like this one. You guys really gonna play this shit all night? We don't have to listen to any music. No? Fine. Play. You sounded beautiful. <clears throat> she's, uh, she's ready to shoot now. Ready? Mm, thank you. <clears throat> Man, she's really obsessed. You know, it's not healthy. You know, she's committed to her art. Yeah, well, she should be committed. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? What? I think there's someone hiding over there. Probably just tap at the scouting for location. It's fine. You know what? Probably that freak from earlier. Caretaker. Oh, yeah, he's creepy. Dude, don't mess with the deliverance man, all right? <laughs> <laughs> what, so it's cool with you guys if you just spies on us all night? I'm cool with it. Yeah, man, totally cool. Not me. Hey, come out. Startled me. Startled you? You were gonna cry. You were so scared. Shut the hell up. Come on, guys. It's dark. It's scary. It's time to shoot. Let's go. Dude, so not. What is wrong with you? So not cool. She, she was funny, dude. Shut the hell up, Lando. <laughs> Longer. Would you like it to be fast or would you like it to be good? I would like for us to get our first shot off sometime tonight. Yeah, you think that attitude helps? Guys, come on. I'm working as fast as I can, Tabitha. Interesting, because I seem to remember you drinking beer and hanging out when you could have been setting up the first shot. Oh, really? That's interesting, because I seem to recall it being daytime! Guys, I am not going to listen to this all weekend. Try to be professional. Just shut, shut up. up, Abigail. <laughs> Where are they? No, no. no, just don't don't touch my lights. Okay, you can touch anything you want. I'm just gonna help. No, no, don't don't help. You're not. You're two, you're two people doing the one man job. Oh, there's a two people walking well, the dog. You can't do Why the one man job. job. Where? Where what? See how long it takes for you to do it. Noah and your slut yep. friend. What did you just say to me? Maddie's the slut? Mm -hmm. The one whose boyfriend you've been sleeping with? <gasps> oh, shit. They're broken up. Now, maybe. Ouch. Guys, come on, we're trying to work. Oh, shut up, Abigail! Why is everyone so mean to me? They're not here, so they must be somewhere together. Tell me. <laughs> Look. I'm really sorry you lost your boyfriend, but before you start calling my friend names, I'm gonna need you to get your facts straight. This is just like Real Housewives. Thanks for your help, Harlow. 
bite me, Kayla. God damn it! Who's been moving my shit? Where is my mask? I swear to God. You did that? Nice. I, it wasn't on purpose. She ran into me and scared me to death. Oh, shut up. Where's Noah? Did you sleep with him? <sighs> Noah, I haven't even seen him. Liar, he's been gone for hours. You've been shacked up in some cabin with him. I told you I haven't seen him. Just so you know, he never loved you. That's what he told me the first time he stayed at my place, which was about a month before you two broke up. Is that true? I heard about it from Tabitha. Yeah, I heard about it from like three people and I don't even know you. Kayla, that was super harsh. She can go cry to Noah about it. Oh! Okay. Well, this all seems pretty freaking important. And I really want this dude to hash this thing out, okay? So I'm gonna go go hide with Lando, okay? Hey, nice. And when I get back, I hope everybody's friends. All right? Good? Cool. Friendship. If I wasn't here, nothing would get done. These bitches don't know anything. They really, they don't know anything. Hello? God, who's there? Oh my god, that wasn't funny! You really scared me! Okay, take the mask off. You're seriously freaking me out. Stop it. I'm serious, please stop. Just take the mask off, it's not fucking funny! You okay? 
Not really, no. You want to be alone? Yeah, I kind of do. He doesn't deserve you, you know? You don't even know me. I think I do. You're good and kind and shy sometimes, but not when you're around your friends. You like mocha ice blended coffee and true crime TV shows. You want to be an actress and you love scary movies. How do you know all that? Just because you haven't noticed me doesn't mean I haven't noticed you. See you later, Maddie. Honestly, I almost feel bad for Maddie. Yeah, but like, did you see her face? I would not want to be Kayla right now. Yeah, well, honestly, Kayla and Noah deserve each other. I know, like, what a bit. <laughs> You guys really, really need to break up. What we have is very special. We are having a goddamn production meeting right goddamn now! You know, I really wouldn't uh, change it for the world. It's not very often that a guy like me gets lucky enough to meet such a beautiful... Production meeting! I'm coming! And I wouldn't trade it for the world. I wish you could experience it, Lando. It's unlike anything I could possibly describe. So, you're not going to the production meeting? Hell no. You? I think it would be an understatement to say that this film has gotten off to a rocky start. My producer has apparently quit. Makeup is nowhere to be found. Where's Cameron? My mask and some of the props have gone missing. My tripod. Krog's tripod! Come on, guys! Someone is trying to sabotage my film. So what does this mean? Are we gonna shoot or what? I can't film anything without Cameron. <laughs> Are you okay? He killed Lando. What?
<laughs> the guy in the mask got his throat. Okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> good acting. I tell you what, that looks just like the fake blood that we brought with us. He's outside, go see for yourself! <sighs> Alright. Great. Hilarious. Seriously. No, he was... He was right here! The guy must have dragged him away or something! <laughs> I'm not lying! Hey! Who's that? Hey. What were you doing out there, man? I was just walking and I, I heard them yelling. Did you see what happened? No. You didn't happen to see a man in a mask carrying a dead body, did you? No. All right, you know what? This is bullshit, man. It's not funny. And I'm done with it. I found... I found those theater kids. What do you mean, found them? What did you do? Jacob, stop! Get off me. Where have you been, man? Just happened to be wandering around back here. Bullshit. Leave him alone. We were just at the lake a couple minutes ago. Whoa, you got back to the cabin way before he did. Where was he? Get your hands off me. What difference does it make? He did or he didn't? I don't give a shit. I just want to get in the car and get the hell out of here now. I'm not waiting here one moment. There is death here and an evil presence. We'll go to the next town and call the cops from there. Let them figure it out. But what about Noah? We have to find Noah. Where did you last see him? He's dead. They're all dead. We don't know that. We're not leaving without him. Maddie, you guys go to the car and and we'll look for him. I'm going with you. <laughs> I don't think so, man. You're staying where I can see you. And I guess you're coming too. Maddie. Maddie, don't do this. Go to the cars. We'll meet you there. It's okay. I saw Noah here, but that was hours ago. We just talked, right? All right, let's get this over with. You all stay here. I'll check around the bed.
go, please. What are we gonna do? So I guess we just hike out. That's a great idea. Let's go in the pitch black where there's a crazed murderer. Oh, but we'll make sure we wear our headlamps. So, so, so what's your idea? Huh? Just hang around here? Wait to be killed? What about the caretaker? What? He lives on the other side of camp. That creep? He's probably the one doing this. He probably has a phone and a car. No, no, I'm not going back out there. I'll go. Me too. Well, shit. Go, 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 go. go. Get, 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 get. Watch out. No, 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 no. You know, I'm starting to think this probably isn't the best idea in the world ever. What, you mean walking around here totally exposed when there's a murderer on the loose? Yeah, that's the one. Hey, you were really brave back there. Didn't help, Jacob. You tried. <laughs> you were just saying that because you thought I was the guy in the mask. No. It's okay. Everyone thought it was me. Cameron, I didn't think that. Thanks, Maddie. Hey, look! That's it. I can't believe this. This is... this is a nightmare! If I die... Don't say that. If I die, there will be so much left undone. I have so much to give! Oh my god, can you shut up? Please, shut up! Oh, I'm sorry. Is my freaking out annoying you? Yeah, it is. Tough shit! Always gotta be the center of attention. Newsflash, people are dead. No one cares about your wasted potential. You don't know anything about me. Oh, I've got you figured out. You're a waste of space and a pain in the ass! And if you die, it wouldn't be a bigger tragedy than anyone else who's died tonight. <laughs> but in your head, in your head, you're just the star of the movie, aren't you? got a truck. Oh, good. I can hotwire it. Really? No, I can't hotwire a truck. What's the plan? Um, he probably has a phone. Maybe uh, the plan is we just knock on the door. Oh, sure. Yeah. You know, why did I even ask? Great plan. Hi, creepy guy. Remember us? Those punk-ass kids that you threatened and sexually harassed? I know you've been sneaking around trying to kill us all day, but can I borrow your truck? We'd really appreciate it. We don't even know for sure that he's the one doing well, it. Well, that's a pretty good bet, don't you think? Well, okay, how about this? We just stand on either side of the door, and if he tries to kill me, you just punch him or whatever? <laughs> yeah, sure. You know what? We will just punch him or whatever.
Hello, Mr. Vic. Vic? Mr. Vic? 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 He's filming his kills. Are you... Are you filming me? Professor Watts. Did you see the expression on her face? She, she trusted the person who stabbed her. This is somebody who knows us. We've got to get out of here. What are you doing? This is evidence. We need to find the others and, and go straight to the police. Surprise. 
Kayla! You can't get away. I found a truck. We have to go. Now. They won't run. No, but, but he made them not run. Maybe he can fix it. We should have killed him. You could do that? He deserves it after what he did. You came back for me. I did. Maddie, thank you. I'm... I'm sorry. For... For all of it. I... Don't thank me yet. I just... I, I don't understand why. Why would he do this? Hey, Maddie. Maddie, you passed the police station. I know we can't go there yet. What? Why, Maddie, turn around. Lando might have gotten one of the cars where he could be right behind us. I have to show you something first. Show me something? At, At school, it's about Professor Watts. Maddie, what are you talking about? Turn the car around. You asked me why you thought he would do this. I think I know. Do you trust me? You have a key? Yeah, Professor Watts gave it to me. Big knife. I stole from Tabitha's crap box. I think it's pretty convincing. Honestly, her phone probably would have been pretty good. Uninspired and derivative, but cool blood effects. That goes a long way. Oh. What did you think, Maddie? 
Maddie, don't run! Don't run! Just shut up! You hit me with a shovel. That's not cool! Why'd you do that? Why? Run, Maddie! Are you seriously going to ask me why? After what you did? With Harlow? Come on, it was part of the act. It looks pretty real to me. Oh, yeah, just like when you hit me in the head with a shovel? Harlow stabbed me, okay, in the back, literally. And I killed her, so uh, I gotta say, I think your jealousy is a little misguided. Stop talking! You ruined my reveal, and now we're missing the climax. Hey, Kayla. What do you think of my final project? I don't understand. Oh, she does, though. You can tell. Oh, this must be so hard for you. Overwhelming. But you need to own up to your part in this. Did you really think I didn't know about you and Noah? I loved him. I really did. He was my person. I'm standing right here. And the two of you were running around behind my back and everyone talking about it, lying to me about it. You killed innocent people. Our friends because of me and Noah. They knew. All of them knew. Except for those theater kids. Those theater kids didn't know Dick. But you know what to say, you can't make an omelet without killing a few theater kids. Shut up, Lando. Okay, got it. But, but I saw you. you. You were afraid. You tried to figure out who did it. Um, she's an amazing actress. Method. Yeah, and that dumb director bitch still didn't let me act in her movie. I'm a great actress. You know how many hits a snuff film is going to get on the dark web? Way more than you would think. I'm going to be famous. We are going to be famous. I'm sorry about your head, baby. You know how jealous I get. You know, I hate to be that guy, but we should probably kill her before campus security comes and unlocks the building. I'll set up the camera. Why her? Professor Watts? She was practice. She was our first. You're insane. You're both insane. No. This is your fault. You thought you could just take whatever you wanted and there weren't going to be any consequences. Well, guess what? Life doesn't work like that. I was nice to you. I was nice to everyone. And what do I get? Yelled at? Made fun of. Forgotten. Not anymore. People are going to remember this. Wait a minute! I'm not ready yet. Get her, you idiot! until she's dead. You kill me and they'll get you. You two are the only ones alive. The school has cameras, Maddie. They'll get you. She might have a point. <laughs> you deserve it. You deserve it for what you did. Wait a minute, she has a point. There's no way to explain this. Lights. Hold on! Camera? Can you wait? Okay. 
action. It's gonna be okay. Hold tight. Sounds like he killed a bunch of kids 30 minutes out of town. The detectives are on the way right now. Jeez. And he filmed it? There's a computer full of evidence on the guy. And there's a video of her killing the guy? Yeah, he killed her friend. So she chopped him in the back with an axe. It's hard to imagine. A tiny little thing like that. Yeah, if it weren't for a video, I wouldn't believe it. When that video gets out, she's going to be famous.